Hi guys. Hi guys. Hey guys. Hi guys. Eat book has hit 100k subscribers. Congratulations. Thank you for the constant support. And without you guys, you guys, we wouldn't have come this far. It's like one of the happier news that we've received amidst this very dreary, very dreadful circuit breaker period. And what else you want to see? In the comments below and see you guys soon. In the meantime, stay safe, stay home, and continue watching our content. 100k! 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 Man, thank you, thank you, thank you, uh, thank you, thank you, thank you, uh, thank you, thank you. Bye! Thank you! Love you all! Love you, eat book! Bye! 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 Now, on to the actual vlog. Too fun. Get ready. Sarah is a new writing chef. <laughs> Welcome to an episode of Eat Book Cooks. I hope you guys are safe because we are safe at home and we are safe in the office. And if you don't already realize, we are doing less of the ebook vlogs and doing more of these ebook cook kind of videos. Today, I'm going to show you how to make oyakudon only using wait for it, one rice cooker. It's foolproof, lazy proof, and Kiara proof because if Kiara can do it, so can you! <laughs> Let's get cooking! <laughs> The recipe we're using serves two portions of oyakudon, so if you're alone at home, just reduce the recipe by half. So the first ingredient that goes into the rice cooker is the rice. We're using jasmine rice here because it's more commonly found in everybody's kitchen, but if you have Japanese rice at home, feel free to replace it. Now that you're done washing the rice, pour all the water out because we're going to use chicken broth instead of water for more flavour. If you have dashi stock, that's even better, but you know, chicken stock is more readily available in everybody's kitchen. We'll set this aside and prep our chicken. Okay, now for the chicken. I would say that this is the most difficult part of the entire cooking process. I give it a difficulty level of 2 out of 5 stars. But yeah, I'm a novice home cook and this is how I debone my chicken leg. So you just use the knife to feel for the bone. Okay, let me coat Sufon, gently wait, wait, can I cut the section. Wow, do you see that? You see, you see, the bone is out. I'm not going to show you the other side of the chicken, but wow, on this side, it looks perfect! <laughs> Ta-da! Okay, like, quite a bit of meat left on the bone, but I tried. So for oyakudon, you want to cut your chicken into bite-sized pieces. Okay, after you're done dicing up the chicken, you can add in the marinade. You need chicken stock, sugar, light soy sauce, and mirin. Very simple, just dump it all in and mix it up. Can I show you how beautiful some chicken cubes are? Some. See this one? Wow, beautiful. This one? Beautiful. Now we'll set this in the fridge to chill and we'll slice up some onions. Oh my god, my eyes are getting pink. Oh my gosh. This time I can, I can act in alternate beginnings. <laughs> See, I added sound effect for you also in case you don't know how to edit that. <laughs> but yeah, now we'll just pour in every single item into the rice cooker and just start cooking. And when you're done, just hit cook. Ring. <laughs> okay, so we have been eyeing the rice cooker and it says 5 minutes left. And this is when you have to prep your eggs. So three eggs or more or less. If you love eggs, maybe five, ten. How about I try to crack in one hand? Let me try. Crack this mix. Perfect. Oh, you saw that? Oh my god! <laughs> For the egg, right? You only need to lightly beat it because you want that really slurp delicious yellow and white egg everywhere on top of it. Oh yeah, good one. Okay, that's it. Oh, oh my gosh, that's nice! <laughs> it smells like oyakudon. Eh? So what we're gonna do is we're gonna pour the egg right on top of the rice, the onions and the chicken. Close the rice cooker back and wait for it to cook a little bit and then open it back up and enjoy. Hey, don't forget to chop the spring onion. 
top. Let me show you something easier. Scissors lah. <laughs> Okay, 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 let's check it out. <gasps> oh my gosh, it looks pretty yeah. Like the yellow is very yellow and the white is very white. <laughs> you know what I mean? Look at it, look at this, look at this. It's so beautiful. I think the main difference is that the ones you get from the restaurant or hawker center is more runny and saucy. This one looks very home cooked. You know, you cooked it in a rice cooker. What can you expect, right? So let's garnish it a little with spring onions and then we'll scoop it into our rice bowl and we'll try it. Okay, right now I'm going to attempt to scoop it up into a bowl without ruining the already aesthetic look of our oyakodon. <laughs> Ooh, hey, Look at the colour of chicken! It looks like it was marinated beforehand because I was expecting something more pale due to the fact that we threw everything in a rice cooker and that's it. But wow! And the rice, it looks like yo fun, you know. You can tell that it's drenched in some kind of sauce or broth. Because when you dump everything in a rice cooker, you can't have that saucy layer on top. Mmm! You can definitely tell that it's a lazier way of cooking because the texture of everything is a bit mushy. But flavor wise, you can taste the chicken, you can taste the sweet. Um, sliced onions. You can taste the savory mirin, like the sauce, chicken broth kind of mixture. I think it's good eh. So today maybe you'll see the true faces behind it book with the producer An and the second cam man Larry. You want to come try? Hi. <laughs> I'm ready. Oh wow. What do you think? Looks, looks. Smell, smell. Eh, hey, but smells wise, right? It smells quite legit eh. Honestly, like when it was cooking just now, we could really smell it from like the vent, the rice cooker vent. The whole office actually smelled like oyakodon. <laughs> the taste is quite nice, eh? Like from a rice cooker, this is not what I would expect. It's pretty similar to oyakodon. I think it's just that the texture is slightly mushier. It doesn't have like, you know, Japanese rice, the grains are usually like more round and nice to eat, right? But because we use jasmine rice, that's why maybe the texture is a bit different. But I think it's still good enough oyakodon substitute. Okay, choose. Deboning of chicken thigh or eating chicken breast? Which one will you choose? One, two, three. Chicken breast. <laughs> <laughs> right, that's me also. <laughs> the onions does add a nice crunch also. Even though I don't eat vegetables, but I eat onions. <laughs> so I'll definitely eat this. Okay, is Larry, you want to try? But actually, right, I never eat oyakodon before. Right? <gasps> you yeah. never? Because like, whenever I eat Japanese food, right, I always eat the basic, like, basic dishes. I never try those like katsudon, mm. oyakudon, like all those don 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 things. Huh? <laughs> you don't like dons? Uh? I don't like it. <laughs> <laughs> wow, it's very fragrant. Mm. Mm. <laughs> this is how you always do it. Mm. <laughs> it's nice eh? It's nice eh? Yeah. But because I never tried oyakudon before right, so I really don't know like what does it taste or the texture or everything right. But trying it for a rice cooker recipe for the first time right, I think I'm gonna give it like 8 out of 10. That's for me, ah. Like, overall, it's a good job. Yay! Can I be married next year? This year? This year. Tomorrow, I get married tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> you can trust Kara's recipe for this one. I think the portions are just nice and it blends well. Like, everything blends well. Like, now I'm very curious to try the real oyakodon in Japanese restaurants, right? Sufon, get ready. Kara is the new rice <laughs> chef. <laughs> Okay, there are still some people left in the office, so let's ask them to come and try our freshly plated bowl of oyakodon. Brenda! <laughs> Hi. Come and try, come and try. Can you tell what this is? Fried rice with egg. First, yeah. <laughs> right. Look a bit like glutinous rice. Don't <laughs> care. Chinese dish. Oh, <laughs> no, it's not Chinese dish. What does it taste? Very Chinese, yeah. Unstoppable. <laughs> it's but okay, it's okay. It's nice. Like, I will eat it again. Mm. Like, the chicken very tender. Nice. Mm. And then the rice is not dry also. I think right, I would have preferred it if the the egg yolk is not fully cooked. Oh. Yeah. If it's the, you know, what's it called? Soft boiled eggs, then you mix with the rice and the shit. Actually that's a good idea. Mm. Maybe instead of doing it our way, we should poach an egg and then let it drizzle. Mm. <laughs> okay, mm. let me tell you, this is actually oyakodon, but it's made only with a rice cooker. Mm. Oh my god. Like you put everything inside, then you just 
Yeah. I think for that amount of effort, right, this is very, very, very good. Like, I will make it at home. Yeah, it's mm. super simple. Oh, it's very oh. nice. I will make it at home. Nice. Because now we all like working from home, right? Yes. Then it's very easy. Like, since it's only made using a rice cooker, I will just put everything in and then I can continue working. Then lunchtime, I go eat. I know, right? Actually, that's a very good idea. Eh? Do you know? Do you know? Do you know that Eatbook also has recipes on our website? Like, oh. it's not just YouTube. We actually do have recipes online as well. Oh, I didn't know. I thought, um, like, your website only has food reviews. Mm, yeah. Wow. So I'll go check it out. You should check it out too. Yes. <laughs> Leo! Yo! Come, come, come! Just oh, hello. drag the turtle out. Hi! <laughs> what is this? You try, you try, you try. It smells delicious, by the way. Yay, nice. Mmm! You know what it is? What, what, what? Oh, yeah, hold on. Yay! <laughs> it's the thing I like to eat at Japanese restaurants. Are you serious? Mm. So, mm. how? You'll be a good judge. What do you think about it? Bamboo. Is it? It's freaking legit. Oh my god, do you cook it in a microwave? No, it's. And my microwave is a. <laughs> <laughs> Air fryer, lah, <laughs> huh? <laughs> 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 Sorry, in a rice cooker. Eh, hey, it works, eh? This is freaking sick, eh? <laughs> yeah, it's oh my god, I didn't know you can make this kind of Japanese cuisine. Yeah, it's like super simple. It's super simple. Yeah, 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 uh, rice cooker one, which I thought was already not bad because it's just like dump the KFC chicken inside and then add like some random sauces. Hey, dude, this rice cooker right, can save lives. Eh. Right. <laughs> you don't even need to, you don't even need to wash like multiple pans and multiple spoons and pots and bowls. I'm, I'm a sucker for rice cooker <laughs> recipes. So yes, yes, yes amazing. <laughs> I approve. So yay! I guess Oyakudon rice cooker recipe is a success. It's easy, it's fast free, and it tastes. Good. So yeah, if you love this recipe, try it out yourself. I can assure you it's good. And if you do that, remember to tag us on IG at eatbooksg so that we can like share and like oh send to each other and be like oh my goodness. Yeah. <laughs> so stay safe during this period and same as usual, if you like this video, you can catch more over there. And don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Bye!